Hello, it's Brick Bros UK and we have our alternative bill for the Lego Ninjago movie Ninjago City Chase 70607, which is a popular set you guys have been asking us to turn into a new build, so it's great to finally be able to share it. Because we've created the alternative bill we're calling the Lego Ninjago Movie Police Pursuit, which includes a police trike, a police station, this small fruit stall, and a shark army aqua flyer. So there's lots more builds to enjoy. And if you want to make this build, you can check out the step by step build tutorial at the end. But first, let's take a closer look at Police Pursuit. Now for this creation we managed to use up all of the pieces, which is a bonus because you won't have any little parts left over. And if we start with the police station, this building is small, but it's got a good design, so it should nicely add to a city scene. You can also see at the front that we made use of the set's two street lamps by putting them either side of the station, but we modified each one by swapping the lights and signs to give them a new look. Moving lower down, the street lamps are connected to a dark grey sidewalk that has a dark red and oriental writing tiled floor colourful entrance into the police station. Now to create the station itself we used a tuk tuk slope black bricks and white windows to make two identical walls then on top the roof's been angled with more sloping black bricks on each end and covered by these white canopy pieces which combined to give the station a decent mix of black and white and for the cherry on top we made a police tile sign for the centre that has red and blue police lights so citizens can see that it's a police station. Swiveling round to the back you can see that the entrance plate walkway extends inside and on the right there's a white evidence table which can be used by Officer Toki to examine accessories. So the inside is very small but it could be expanded on with your own parts, however overall it's a nice building to use in play or as part of the Ninjago city backdrop. Next up it's Officer Toki's police trike which is a little city vehicle that will help the cop chase criminals down tight streets. And on its front it has a single wheel, sloping white bonnet, headlamps either side and a police tile sticker. Then behind this area is the windscreen that has red and blue lights and as we come round there's a single seat with handlebars and a clip for the officer's handcuffs. And for play you can easily clip in Officer Toki when he needs to chase criminals. And finally from the sides you can see that the trike has two wheels at the back as well as some police badge sticker detail which completes its design. So overall it's a good looking small police vehicle that's fun to drive around the city. Following on from the police trike we didn't want to leave out Ham so we gave him a small fruit stall which is made from spare parts and pieces but it looks quite good because there's a tan box that holds the apples and cherries. Then for advertisement as well as decoration we stuck two market signs on the end to stand out. So it's a smaller bill compared to Ham's original market stall but we felt he deserved to keep his job in the city selling fruit plus it gives Nier and Lloyd a place to visit. And last up it's the Aqua Flyer which we will admit does have a Sky Pirate sort of design but it gives the Shark Army Thug a much needed flying vehicle to battle the ninja. So looking at the front there's a red movable search lamp that can help spot the ninja. Then on both sides for firepower we created swiveling cannons that have long black barrels, gold nozzle ends and trans red studs for their back blast. There's also extra pipe detailing and silver fish fins on the wings and on the underside we attach gold clips just for colour and flight stabilisers. Moving to the centre the cockpit was super easy to make because we just used a round wooden crate which is where the thug can climb aboard to take control. And at the back it has a sloping wooden tail with flexible red fins to help it steer. Now as an additional feature we attach the rope piece to the bottom of the flyer so the two ends can dangle down a bit like a jellyfish and these come in handy because the aqua flyer can zoom in and pick up civilians or the ninja to drag them away. So overall the aqua flyer is the perfect vehicle for the shark army thug to even up the fight. On a final note our police pursuit alternative bill was really fun to make because instead of just having a tuk tuk and market stall you now have a police trike, police station, fruit stall and the aqua flyer which as you've just seen have nice individual designs so they will fit into the ninjago city scene or a mock. But the best bit is the builds will help expand play because the ninja and officer Toki on his trike can chase down the shark army thug in his aqua flyer then take him to the station for questioning and once their work's done for the day they can enjoy some fruit at the fruit stall. So if you like the look of this build and want to make it then please watch on now to check out the step by step build tutorial.
And that's the finished build, so now you can enjoy our police pursuit, or maybe you've taken inspiration from the build to make something more awesome. Hope you enjoyed a Brick Bros UK alternative build, and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to Brick Bros UK.